share with you a little bit of a tip and trick that I use to prepare and wash all kinds of vegetables. So, we have all of these beets and they're so full of mud and dirt, it's really impossible for me to wash them inside the house. But, I did a product review a year ago on this EcoSpin, and this is actually for clothing, but I don't use it for clothing, I use it for my produce. So it's an EcoSpin and you're supposed to be able to wash your clothes in it. It didn't really work that effective for me, but let me tell you what I found out does work. And we do is we're going to get the majority of the mud off these beets. Then we're going to put them in this. Basically, this is a, like a large salad spinner. I washed my cucumbers and all kinds of things. Now, you don't want to wash your potatoes because once you wash your potatoes, you won't be able to store them for long term. Never wash your potatoes if you want them to be stored for a long time. But these beets we're going to be canning today. See how muddy and dirty this water is? It would make such a mud mess in the house. And we're going to fill this up with water. I'm going to stop the water for a moment. I'm going to put this lid on it. And we are going to start turning. So basically, we're washing all of these beets. And it works really easy. Avalon Bay Eco Spin. Not for your clothing, <laughs> for washing your harvest. Then there's an attachment at the end, right here you can see, and we're just going to let all the yucky water out. All right, see how nice and clean they look? We're gonna close the drainage and we're gonna do it another time. I hope you liked this video on just a little tip of using a off-the-grid washing machine not for your clothing, but washing your fruits and your vegetables. It works great with green beans and cucumbers and beets, all of the things that you have in your garden. It also works really good for all kinds of spinach and lettuce. Sometimes you just have to think outside the box. Take care everyone, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Hey, let me know in the comments below. Do you have one of these wonder washers or spinners like this? I'd love to hear what you have to say. If you like videos like this about my harvest in my garden, hey, check out the videos beside me and down below. There's hundreds of videos that I share with you all kinds of tips and tricks about having a garden even when you don't have much of a budget.